were you guys able to do to come back and win this thing? First, we started slow. We started real slow. They had us the first half. I'm not going to lie. But it took guts. It took an attitude. It was awesome. Awesome. Wow! That's it. I give up. I'm in troll by my own mum. It's here. It's now. It's game day. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, it is that time again. Your favourite show of the week. Another all or nothing special will be bringing you Let's with Garden City Eagles on the road for this way fixture as we head down the A1. It will take us just over an hour at 43.3 miles where we head over to Homer Green Sports Association where it's Homer Green, the Let's with Garden City Eagles. Eagles in this Spartan South Midlands Division 1 fixture. I go to all this effort to bring you content, coming back out of retirement, being stitched up at the Vloggers Awards. Everyone knows that I should have won that. So you only have my own mother banned to me saying, why do you bother making these videos? Only one person likes it on Facebook. Yes, I've got that one friend that likes everything. Thank you. I appreciate it. Little does she know that I'm a YouTube sensation. But anyway, that's another chatting. Bollocks. Let's get the front nose! Hobart Green finished rock bottom last season in step five in the premiership of the Spartan South Midlands Football League where they finished 20th where they played 38 games and ended on 29 points. They currently sit rock bottom of our division. After 13 games they've got 8 points where they've won 2, drawn 2 and lost 9. Jez Hodges has currently taken the reins, whether he's temporary or it's a long-term thing, where he's taken 12 games, winning three, drawing three, losing six, giving a win percentage of 25%. Here's Omar Green's Danger Man. I don't care about your I don't give a fuck. Oh, shit. Here we go again. Never played each other. So that's one for the Guinness Book of Records. So, with that all being said, let's get to the grand. Let's get some team news in. Let's get three points. And then let's... Let get the fuck out of here. Up the Eagles! <laughs> I love doing football, kids love doing, go out and love it, that's it. Just go out and enjoy yourself. All I'm asking is for 100% work rate, and this game will be a lot more easier. Eagles on three! One, two, three! Eagles! Eagles! Yes! <laughs> Eagles! 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 Darryl Reed, goalkeeper. Lad has just gone forward. I didn't know who's signing. Defender. Sam James. Payne, midfielder. Carl Oswald, midfielder. Danny Charles, midfield. Luke Schimmel, midfielder. Danny Coughlin, midfielder. Mark Summers, striker. Oh, we got defender. Spencer Thomas, defender. Right, that centre forward. Homer Green to get this game underway, kicking from left to right. Or right to left, I guess, depending on what way you stand. Did that, actually, did, that, did that ever make any sense when they used to say they're kicking from right to left or left to right? It never made any sense. Oh, there's a game going on. Anyway, uh, Homer Green attacking. This shot caught me completely off guard as it rattles the inside of our post but comes back out for Daryl to collect. Good thing that didn't go in. Summers with a keeper to beat who's committed to his right hand side of the post. And we've dragged it wide. All of that space to hit the target, we've dragged it wide. Homer Green on the attack with the ball player to number two. 
looking to drive forward. He sees number 11, he's played it in. Kamal making his debut today. He's lunged in. Oh, what is this going to be? That looked very much like it was either just that side. But if it's on the line, it's a penalty. The referee's going to have a word. And the penalty's been awarded. The Lino said it was on the line. That's a penalty. That's our second penalty we've given away in two games. As 11 steps up. And he slops it into the opposite side to Daryl. And we are 1-0 down after about 7-8 minutes. A free kick to Letras to be played in by Kenny Loggins. All the way over to the back post as Kane flicks it in. Summers, open goal. He's hit the menace. Ah, oh, he's unmarked at the back post. We could have been back in the game just like that. But Homer Green are breaking. Can Sammy make it? He skipped past Sammy, number 11. He's played the ball into the box. And Daryl claim. Fuck! End-to-end -end stuff as Homer Green would play this free kick all the way to the back post. Number 11 will play it across goal. Kenny Log is to clear. Sammy James would chase this down. He's got Kano in front of him. What's his options? Would he lift it long? He's played it into Kano. Kano's got a man up his ass. He hasn't scanned. And we give away another free kick. Should we have gone long? Free kick for Homer Green. 50p there by Kenny Loggins. As number five will look to drop the shoulder and play this into a dangerous area. Number seven, can he get a shot off? He has, and Daryl suck a leg out. Ball's just lofting as Kamal will try to head this away. Number four's beaten Danny to the head, and number seven with an half volley, just put it in the back of the net. And it is 2 0. We are 2 0 down after about 20 minutes against the bottom of the league. Another set piece for Homer Green, played into a dangerous area. That will be cleared away. Number eight will claim. Plays it into number 10, who drops the shoulder, skips past one. He's got the freedom to have a shot. A little bit too hot for Daryl, but he claims straight after. Kenny Loggins to get us back into this game. Just over the bar, corner to Homer Green. Daryl to claim. It slipped out of his hands, Danny will clear. Straight into the path of Daryl, but he couldn't keep hold of that one. The danger's not gone yet. As the ball's lifted back in again. Daryl could not get onto that one. That was a free header. Kenny Loggins looking to put his ball into a dangerous area. Summers has slipped over. Homer Green will clear. Into path of a door. He will try to play a ball through, but it's been cut out by number two. He's seen something. The break is on. There's number nine burst through. Daryl's come out. Daryl's kicked that one wide. Number eight takes an exclusive shot and it's gone for a goal kick. I don't know where I got exclusive from. Big boy to carry this four for Homer Green. As he looks to play the one two and receive again as that ball's cut in. Dempsey's been beating for pace. The ball's in number seven. Did he put out that one? Did he think he was going to get clattered? Either way, that's a let off. But the danger's not gone. As two will whip this back in. That will be a way by Doy. Two of our players gone for one ball. Let's talk there, gentlemen, and listen, please. As Kenny Loggins will look to clear this high, and that'll be a throw in. Number nine has been put through. Kamal's got some work to do to try and catch up with him. He's been forced wide. He's pulled off the shot. Daryl saved that, but is that a foul after the shot? And yes, it is. The referee has pointed to the spot. That's two penalties given away on his debut. What a debut from hell that's got to be. 11 to step up, trying to make it 3-0. He's missed. Daryl saved that with his feet. But he scored the rebound, and that is 3-0. Fuck this shit, I'm out. Mm -mm. Fuck this shit, I'm out. No thanks. Don't mind me. I'ma just grab my stuff and leave. Excuse me, please. Fuck this shit, I'm out. And with that, the referee is called half time. Homer Green, free. Let's just go on City Eagles, nil. Well, being depressing. You guys, footballers, I can't play football for you, but obviously some of you don't want to be here. We've got enough to lose. I'm not going to scream. I told you I ain't going to scream. Action speak loud in the words. There will be some changes. This is some of your last games in there. Let's see what you've got second half, and we'll go home happy. Well, let's see what kind of reaction the lads will give us after the first half display. Can it get any worse? Big boy for Homer Green trying to cut inside. But the non-league Patrick Vieira with those long legs of ease will cut that out and play that into Kenny Loggins, who will lift this down the line. Straight into the menace. It's another little flick over to Summers. Into Kenny Loggins. And the counter-attack is on. What have we got available? The ball's played through to the menace. Can he nick it in? Ah, oh, the keeper's made a save on that one. That's a good start from us. Non-league Patrick Vieira driving forward as he plays the ball over to Kenny Loggins. He will cut sides. Left foot, it's not a bad effort and it's better than what we had in the first half. Ball played into Summers, strike, been blocked, second bite of the cherry, another block, third bite of the cherry, that's not the same, but it's in! Left foot and in the game on, 3-1, we're back in this game. We've got a mountain to climb, but it's not over yet. How we battled to claim this ball, he's done a little cut inside and he plays it into Danny. Danny looking to lift this long, into the menace, he's got a one-on-one. -on -one. But back up is recovering as the menace twists and turns. Cross. That's handball, surely, ref, all day long. How have you not given that? 
How can you say that? That's against his chest. Go and have a word with him. You did in the first half and gave them a penalty. Just want to point out that all of these officials were being assessed today. And that Lino, you can see, said, I don't care that I'm being assessed. It doesn't bother me. So there you go. People who control the game don't want to improve. They are more powerful than the Mafia. If we don't get respect, no games get played. And unfortunately, they hold the FA to ransom. And surprise, surprise, the handball wasn't given. Either way, we didn't score from that either. Kenny Loggins up with the launch, just throwing in and to shoot on sight to a doy. Oh, what a sensational goal that is. It's 3-2. We are back in this game. 3-0 down at half-time. It's now 3-2. The mountain's getting easier to climb. We are piling on the pressure as the mess goes through. The keeper's made a save on that one. Summers follow-up. Keeper just does a little drag back and he'll clear that. As calm as you like. Kenny Loggins looking to play this corner ball in. Flick on by the non-league patch of Vieira. The summer's at post. And it's 3-3! What a comeback that is! 3-0 when you fucked it up! Get in there! Shoots on sight, looking to cross this ball. Summers, he's been pushed out to Kenny Loggins. He's dropped the shoulder. He's gone round one. Oh, and it's just cleared by the defender. That was almost an open goal. We are knocking on this ball as shoot on sight goes round the keeper. Can he stay on his feet? A shot. It's not a post. And it's in! We are there leading from 3 0 down to 4 3 up. I cannot believe what I have just witnessed. What a comeback! Corner to Homer Green as they try and claw back into this game. It's away by Kenny Loggins. And then non Lee Patrick Vieira. Summer's got a flick on. Summer's dives in. That's desire to win. It's a dangerous free kick that we could have done without conceding, but we had to do something to stop it as Summer stops the first cross coming in. And a shot has gone over the bar. Oh, this team makes me fuck my demons not to pick up a drink. This is the last kick of the game. It's another free kick that we are trying to defend as Daryl will claim. And he'll take his time. Oh, referee, can you blow up, please? I don't think I can take any more even reliving this again. As he tells Daryl to speed it up. How about you speed your clock up? And the minutes is away. Is there a last minute attack from us? Can we claim another goal? Are we looking to go into the corner? Just hold on to it, gents. We don't need to do anything stupid, but you, referee, feel free to blow your whistle at any time. Oh God, I think I need to meditate after this game. Maybe even masturbate. I don't know, one or the other. Maybe even both at the same time. I don't know. And that's it. It's full time. We won the game for free. <laughs> Come on. Well done to actually everybody in it. Well done. Mark, oh, Nate, what a performance that was. That was definitely a game of two halves. First half, 3 0 down. Second half, we've scored four goals. What are your feelings and thoughts on that whole performance? Honestly, it's speechless. I think first half, nowhere near it. All the boys nowhere near, nowhere near it. To be 3 0 down at half time against Bob League, obviously disappointing, but eminently proud of the boys for the character they show. Both scored four goals in the second half, they didn't stop. And then just to hang on to it as well to get the three points. What's going for your thoughts at half time half? Trying to get these boys up for the second half and now uh, we're walking away with three points. Well, it's a twist of us to make some difficult decisions that work for us today. This is probably the second, maybe third game that we've had poor first half performance. That's something we really need to work on. But second half performance, game of FIFA that was, wasn't it? No, it definitely <laughs> was. <laughs> Proud of the boys today. A win to win, no matter how you get it this stage of the season, we got a win, three points in the bag. That team's beat three teams, whoever they may be, could have turned us over today. So we've gone from a loss, a draw, and now a win. So hopefully we can take some momentum out of that and move forwards. Well, where do I start with this one? I could say that we should never have been 3 0 down in the first place. But what right do we have to say that? A game of football is so random, anything can happen and anyone can beat anyone. And the fact that we've been poor the last few games shows we deserve to be 3 0 down at half time, even if it was against the bottom of the league. But it doesn't matter how you start, it's about how you finish. And that's all that matters. Credit to the lads for turning it around. Some harsh words and real truth were spoken at half time. And I think it gave them the momentum to kick on. I do love a cliche, and you're only as good as your last game. So we have to wait and see what the next game brings. All the action happens down with Letchworth Garden City Eagles. I don't know why some of you ain't jumping on this bandwagon right now. If it's coming to support us or watch these videos, you are always going to be entertained. Let's try and get Letchworth Garden City Eagles as everyone's second favourite team. So until next time, you know what to do. Tyler, Richard, get that song on! <laughs> Say goodbye.
Bye.